Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Kavya here and I hope you all are doing good. This would be a very interesting video where I'm going to share the affordable products which are around 500 rupees. If you're new to this channel then please subscribe to my channel and also get connected with me on Instagram. All the links will be in the description box below so please do check out. So now let's get started. Before I start, I wanted to say you guys that I have also included products that are priced around 500 rupees, that is like 585, 535 rupees. So this is a normally priced or you may get the product around 500 rupees during the sale. I'm going to get started off with the primers. So basically primers are the base for all the face makeup it forms the base with foundation and as it allows you know the makeup to go on smooth and also it helps the makeup to last for longer period also the primers closes the large open pores it reduces the blemishes and brightens the face like a lacme primer so i'm going to show you what are the best primers available in indian market for you guys the first i would recommend is um, the ellie girl pro prep hd high definition smoothing face primer this is one of the best primer and um, this costed for around uh, 450 rupees if I'm not wrong. The second primer I'm going to uh, recommend is the Lakme Absolute Blur Perfect Makeup Primer. This is so nice, it brightens the face instantly and this is my favorite primer for now. Other budget friendly makeup primers are a Lactocalamine. I'm going to definitely recommend this as a primer and this is so thing in a budget. The last primer I have with me is this Patanjali Aloe Vera Gel. Definitely you can use any of the aloe vera gel as your face primer. Uh, definitely this is recommended. Moving on with the CC and the BB creams, if you're looking for a sheer coverage, definitely you, uh, I recommend you know BB cream and CC cream. So I have three BB cream and CC cream with me. The first one is the Pons BB cream. The second one is the Lacme CC cream complexion care cream. And the third one is the Garnier cream. Upon these, the Garnier one is my favorite, but definitely these two are very well and they give the sheer coverage to the skin. If you're looking for a medium to high coverage, um, then definitely you have to go for a foundations. The first foundation I have with me is for the medium coverage, I have with me is the Lacte Absolute Argan Oil Serum Foundation. This was the new release in the market. I absolutely love this. this the liquid uh, for foundation. I, I I love liquid foundations. So yes, this is one of the medium, um, you know, a uh, coverage foundation, and it is amazing. Um, the second foundation I have with me is the Maybelline Fit Me foundation. The Fit Me range in Maybelline is so famous and trendy. So definitely, this is um, also the best foundation, and also um, this uh, this gives the medium coverage for your skin. Uh, if you're looking for a medium foundation, again, I have one from Lacme. This is the Lacme Perfecting Liquid Foundation. This is amazing. This is the basic foundation of the Lacme. And yes, definitely, this is recommended. And definitely, this is in such a budget, right? To remove the dark circles, to reduce the blemishes, and to take off the dark spots, concealers are of great help, right? The one I totally, totally recommend and you have to have in your vanity is the LA Girl Pro Conceal. There are a variety of shades in LA Girl Pro Conceal um, range. I definitely recommend this is one of the best concealer I see in the market and the shades are so good you can definitely buy all of the shades I have four shades with me from LA Girl um, I can mix and match and get you know according to my um, skin and yes this is one of the uh, concealer the second one I have is definitely from um, Fit Me range from um, Maybelline this is also one of the best affordable um, concealer the third one I have is the stick uh, concealer from a Lacme Absolute um, White Essence Concealer Stick uh, it has SPF 20 so so this is in a form of stick concealer I like this so yeah um, I use the stick concealer when I use the liquid foundation so definitely this is good so that's about concealers so to make the concealer and foundation creaseless last long and 
flawless definitely you have to set the concealer and foundation with a powder um, I definitely recommend using any of the compact powders you have or um, the one I showed you so the one I have is this Lacme Rose powder with its cream so definitely I use this um, you know powder to set my whole of foundation and concealer you can also use this white tone face powder this is so nice it smells so good yes and it definitely you know make the concealer and foundation um, creaseless this is such a thing in a budget this is for 55 rupees so yeah go for this now moving on with the contouring the contouring is so necessary it's it's gonna define your face and it's gonna you know make your face look slim so contouring is definitely necessary it's just a trick that you need to learn so the um the contouring kits i have is the one from simana colors oops the one from Sivana Colors, it's the Ultra Blush Palette. Oh my god, this is so good. I definitely recommend this palette. The second one I have is this Maybelline V Face Blush Contour Kit. This is so small and good. So we have, um, you know, the brown shade here. So definitely you can use this to contour your cheek and also your nose. So yeah. The next one I have is this uh, Elegant Pro Conceal um, in the shade. I'm not sure which shade is this. Um, this is in the shade Beautiful Bronze. This is definitely such a beautiful contouring. Um, this is definitely recommended. Again, I have used this in one of my makeup tutorial and my pink party makeup tutorial. So definitely you can have a look on how this contouring is. Now to highlight your high points and cheekbone. Highlight is so much necessary. The one I totally recommend recommend is this, you know, um, Sivana Shining Star Shimmer Brick. This is so amazing. I got this brick from Amazon. You have the similar, um, you know, shimmer brick from Bobbi Brown as well. I think this is the tube of, you know, Bobbi Brown. This is so amazing. So this brick is definitely budget friendly. It does what it has to do. And it also has a variety of colors in highlighters. So definitely you can go, you know, and play around with. So yes, this is definitely you must buy. The second highlighter, and it's one of my favorite, is this L'Oreal True Match Lumi um, Liquid Glow Illuminator. It's a liquid highlighter. I like to use this highlighter with, uh, you know, mixing with foundation. So it gives that shiny uh, uh, glow on the face. This is definitely one of my favorites. And the thing is, you have to keep a watch so that, you know, it will be an offer. I got this liquid illuminator for around, you know, 520 rupees. I got this from Jipong. So, yeah. Next best highlighter is this highlighter from Essence. So Glow Cream to Powder Highlighter. This is so nice, actually. This is nice and, yeah. This is definitely recommended. The next highlighter I recommend is this Colorbar Radiant Glow uh, Highlighter. It's in a pencil form, um, so you have to, you know, um, press at the back, and so you get the highlighter from this end. So yeah, this is also a liquid form of highlighter, and I have used this in one of my tutorial, and you can see how it is. So this is my favorite too. To get that pinch of charm on your face, blush is so important, right? So the one I recommend is this from Nika K. It has two, you know, variety of blush shades. This is orange and a peach kind. You can definitely mix these two and get a nice combination of blush on your cheek. So this is one of the best budget-friendly and my favorite high, uh, blush. So the second blush I have is this one from Maybelline. Um, this is the cheek cheek glow blush cheeky glow blush this this was just for 200 rupees i guess and yes definitely this is good the third blush i recommend is again from maybelline it's their dream mousse blush i'm not sure how you pronounce but yeah again this is from maybelline i have almost hit the small box it also you know this this particular one from Maybelline acts as a blush and as a highlighter too so definitely this gives a warm nice blush you know it adds a charm to your, to your face so definitely this is recommended 
Now talking about colouring your eyelids, that is the best affordable um, eyeshadow palettes I have with me is the first one I'm going to show you is this from Amova Makeup Academy Eye Dust Powders. These are eye pigments that I got from Nika. These are so cute. So we have various colours. I saw teal green, a brown, a black and I got this shade. And I got this shade and it's called shade 5 so this is the one I'm applying to my eyes right now this turned out to be so good and yeah this is highly affordable and it's highly pigmented as well and yes this is um, for uh, 150 rupees from Nika so the second one I'm going to talk about is from a Revlon this is so good this was for around I'm not sure but I think this was for around 150 rupees this is such a nice shade it's a nice peach peachy pinky color it's a small palette so we have a variety of you know shades in uh, in this kind of uh, palette range so definitely you can check this out and I got this from Nika the second the the next one I have over me and it's totally affordable is I lost the palette Okay, I found it. This is from a Blue Heaven. The cost of this, you know, a small palette was around 105 rupees. I think um, this is a good. Uh, it has four shades like purple, green, maroon to pink, light pink color. So definitely this is good. I'm going to try a tutorial on Blue Heaven and yeah, you can find a review on this. But definitely I recommend this for such a less price. Moving on to the thing I cannot live without is Kajals. So definitely one of the best which is a smooth, smudge proof and long lasting and my favorite upon all kajals available in the market is this plum kajal oh my god this is so amazing this is so dark it lasts long you can create a black smoky eye with this and this is heavenly you know I just love this if you do not have this kajal go ahead and buy it this is so good and um, the only thing I don't like with this is you know the pencil thingy you need to have a sharpener but apart from that this is highly highly recommended from my end the next four uh, kajals I have is um, Sorry, the three kajals I have with me is the one from Nika Rock the Line Kajal. This I definitely recommend for your daily use. You can use this, you know, if you're uh, if you're college going girl and if you want to uh, want to have a kajal, then this is definitely recommended. The next one I have is a um, Calabar Mesmerize Kajal. This is definitely dark, intense, and um, yeah, this is smudge proof as well. Um, so yes, this is definitely good. The last one I have is from Faces. Uh, it's a magnet eyes kajal. It's waterproof, smudge proof and dermato dermatologically tested. So yes, this is one of the, uh, again, if, you know, um, best, you, uh, best for a daily use. So definitely I recommend these kajals. Moving on with mascara, which is affordable and good is from Maybelline. Uh, it's their Hypical Volume Express Mascara. This is totally recommended and it's to the its budget. The second one I have is from Lakme Iconic Cuddling Mascara. This is amazing and yeah, these two are budget and good mascaras, uh, you know, for below 500 range. Moving on to the most interesting part, lipsticks. Oh my god, the most recommended brown shade is this one from Lakme 9 to 5 Weightless Meat Mousse Lip and Cheek Color. It's in the shade Cocoa Soft. I mean, I wore in many of the videos and many of you asked which shade is this, which shade is that. So that is Cocoa Soft. This is the best brown shade. And the next one I have is with respect to red, the best red lipstick you can have a uh, within 500 is this Lakme 9 to 5 a creaseless uh, lipstick it's in the shade red coat i have to show you this oh my god it's over i cannot twist up this is uh, my favorite and I'm, I'm going to definitely buy this i'm going to restock this again now moving on with the best pink shade i have with me the smudge me not sugar lipstick 
it's a liquid lipstick um this is so nice it lasts forever oh my god this is definitely nice it's a bright fuchsia pink shade so um it's in the shade rethink pink i have a complete review of the sugar smudge me not lipstick so have it check so moving on to the nudes nudes are in fashion but the only thing is you have to find the right shade for yourself so um the one i have with me is from nika it's in the shade naughty nude i think naughty nude suits um my skin tone so definitely you can try this naughty nude shade this is one of the best nude lipstick the next one i have with me is the shade you know this looks like orange sometimes i'm not sure so but whenever i wear people ask me which shade is this so um this is from color it's in the shade hearts and tarts oh my god this is so good i think it has orange undertones and it's very very good so yes, that's about it guys. Um, these are the affordable makeup products around 500 rupees. So let me know if you want to know or uh, know if you want a review of any of the products. Please do let me know what other videos you expect from me in the future. And make sure you get like, comment and subscribe. And also follow me on my Instagram. All the link will be listed in the description box below. I'll see you soon in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye. I love you all so much. Bye. Take care.